Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the three phase induction motor star delta starter. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notification. Soft copy of this material available in the drive, link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic star delta starter. In order to start the motor, we are using the one type of the starter is star delta starter. The stator winding during the starting it is connected with the star connection. During the running, it is connected with the delta connection. So, this is the method used in the star delta connection. This is most commonly used for induction motor. Normally used starter is the star delta starter. Now, we will see refer the diagram. So, this is the stator winding is available. So, stator winding, right? 1, 1 dash, 1 phase, 2, 2 dash, another phase, 3, 3 dash, third phase. So, here the three phase AC supply is available. So here the change over switch is available, TPST switch is available here. So this one side, it is connected with the star connection. If you connect the switch in this bottom end, it is the stator winding is connected with the star connection. That is 1 dash, 2 dash and 3 dash are connected. If the switch is connected in the upper end, then it is a delta connection. That is the winding, the portion 1, 2, 3 are connected. Right. So, during the starting, the, the TPST switch is placed in the star connection. That is clearly given starting, it is connected star connection. Why we are connecting star connection? In the star connection, the current, the voltage is reduced by the factor 1 by root 3. In case the, the nature of the star connection is only 1 by root 3 of voltage will be applied to the stator winding. So, due to this reduced voltage, the current drawn by the stator also reduces. Once the, once the induction motor gain the normal speed, the switch is changed over to the running condition, that is the delta connection. The switch is changed from, the TPST switch is changed from bottom to the top. So, that the, start, the induction motor stator winding is connected with the delta connection. So, during delta connection, it will draw the, it will draw the full voltage, root 3 times of voltage, so that the rated voltage will be applied to the delta, uh, stator winding, so that the current drawn by also gradually increases and motor will run at the normal speed. So, the main aim is during starting, the stator winding is connected with the star connection in order to reduce the voltage 1 by root 3. Once the motor gain the normal speed, normal voltage, the, ch the connection is changed to the upper end of the TPST switch so that it is connected with the delta connection. Now we will see the description. It has the triple pole double thrown switch. TPST switch is available. TPDT. Triple pole double thrown. The TPDT switch connects the stator winding in star at the time of starting. So, at the time of starting, we connected with the star connection. Why it is connected star connection? The phase voltages get reduced by the factor 1 by root 3. The nature of the star connection is the voltage is 1 by root 3 times. The current will be same, but the voltage will be 1 by root 3 times. So, due to this reduced voltage is given to the stator and the starting current is limited because the voltage applied is only 1 by root 3 because of star connection. Due to the reduced voltage given to the stator, the starting current also limited. That is our main aim. Main aim of the starter is to limit the starting current. After the motor gains the normal, normal speed, the switch is thrown into the other side that is delta. So, the starter gets the rated voltage. So, the initially it is given in star connection, it will draw, it will take only 1 by root 3 of voltage, so that the starting current is limited. After gaining the normal speed, the switch is thrown into, thrown into another side, it is a delta connection. During this delta connection, it will get the rated voltage. The relays can be used for operation of the switch. The change over, the changing the switch from star connection to delta connection can be done by the relays. Now, we will see the advantages and disadvantages of this method. The advantage is cheapest of all type of starter. Only we have one switch is there. We are connecting in star connection, thereafter delta connection. No more additional equipments are needed. 
so that it is the cheapest method maintenance free operation there is no no other uh, parameters are the equipments are available only the change over switch is there so the maintenance also free free operation maintenance free operation cheapest as well as maintenance free operation now what are the disadvantages used only for normal delta connection motor if the stator winding is connected in delta then only we can use this starter because the stator winding is initially connected with the star finally it is connected with the delta so the we need a delta connected motor then only we can use this motor delta connector motor is needed and factor by which the voltage is changed to 1 by root 3 at the beginning we we are applying only 1 by root 3 of time of voltage but it cannot be varied always it is 1 by root 3 we cannot change it with the lower value or higher value we cannot vary this always it is 1 by root 3 times of uh, the rated voltage so these are all the disadvantages so in this video we discuss about the star delta starter three phase induction motor subscribe the channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive link is given in the description box thank you for listening